Go Powercat here with 2022 Grapevine product, offensive lineman Drake Beckwith. Tough loss tonight, but it was fairly close. How close do you feel like your team's getting to where you want to be this season? Um, definitely getting a lot closer. We had a great jump from last week to this week. I feel like the O-line in general, we played just so much better, a lot more physical, a lot more um, set on the scheme. And I'm just really proud of us. We really made a big jump, so we're moving in the right direction. So. What are some of your personal goals as far as, you know, the rest of your senior season? And then how does that help with your team goals there? Yeah. Um, for personal, I'd say um, not giving up any, any sacks. I think that's always just every game's going, not wanting to give up any sacks. Um, I just want to, you know, really focus on being a leader, you know, being a captain this year. That's something I really want to develop on. And I think that'll help our team in general. And I just kind of want to teach the guys how to be physical up front. So. Moving on to K-State, walk us through your recruitment and then up to the commitment and what your relationship was like, you know, through through your recruitment. Yeah, so um, kind of midway through the spring, I kind of got some calls from Coach Riley. He just started reaching out, and, you know, I was just kind of, you know, touching base with him. And then I got invited to a camp, and I went up to that, and I did pretty good, and I got an offer from there. A couple days later, I committed. Um, it was pretty smooth. Um, just really love it up at K-State, so. And you, you mentioned Connor Riley, uh, offensive line coach. He was here tonight watching you. What excites you about playing for a coach like him? Um, he's just a great guy, and that's just something you just want to play for, someone you want to play for. He's just, he's just so, you know, with you all the time, and it's just, it makes you want to just do, do very well. So. And you will be, your brother will be joining you at Casey. How exciting is that for you? It's super exciting. You know, I love playing football with him. You know, he's just a ton of fun to watch and play with. So just having him going with me, it's just going to be a great opportunity. Now I'm assuming you guys have a group chat probably with all the other commits and recruits. Do you guys talk at all a little bit? Actually, no. I really I've talked out. I've talked to the uh, a little bit to the other O-line uh, commit, but other than that, I haven't really talked to any of the K-State guys. Uh, actually, I've talked to uh, Sterling Lockett a little bit, but nothing too much. All right. Now K-State plays Stanford here tomorrow. Are you going to be able to make it to the game? Yeah, I think so. We do have a um, a funeral for you know a dear uh, supporter of our team, so that's that's going to be a little conflict. But I'm hoping I can get there at the back half of the game.